Hi, today we're going to look at what happens when someone is being negative uh, within your group. And, and again, this is if there's that, that constant or, or, or consistent uh, negativity from a person or, or, or group of people within your group. The, one of the first things you can do is if you see the, the conversation uh, start to, to lead towards that negativity, it's just to try to gently redirect that negativity of saying, well, thank you for sharing, but really remember, we want to build people up. Um, and it sounds like we're, we're starting to get to a place where we're tearing people down and, and not encouraging them. And, and so that's a, one way to redirect. Uh, it's important that uh, that is not allowed to happen if there's negativity towards people in a group, that that just stops right away uh, and is not allowed to continue. Uh, it needs to be a safe place for all people. And if people are being negative towards uh, uh, one or more people in the group, that that just uh, ceases to be a safe, a positive place where sharing and support can happen. The other thing that can often happen within a group uh, is that there might be some negativity towards your church or your organization or people in that uh, in your church, your pastor or other leaders. And you need to be a guard for that too. Whether you agree with the comment or not, um, that's not the time and the place to have that discussion. Uh, it's it's uh, it's against what's trying to happen by building community. And, and so again, just to redirect that conversation and discussion of saying, well, it sounds like you're really frustrated about that. You need to talk to that person, but this is really not the place to have that uh, conversation. I'd encourage them to, to go to that person and talk to them. And if they keep bringing it up or won't let it drop, uh, you might need to be more firm in that of saying, this really is not the place to have that discussion. Uh, we're trying to discuss this and, and, our, and, and to lead that towards a more positive way. Uh, if you need to take them aside, if it's something that happens week after week, uh, and, and let them know that that's not the appropriate place to handle that. Uh, talking with your pastor or the person that's uh, that they're struggling with uh, may be an outlet for you to uh, to get other counsel or advice in that. God's blessings to you. Those are not diff uh, easy conversations to have when, when folks are being negative, but it's so important as a small group leader to, to direct things towards in a positive way uh, and the, real, the restoration and the hope and the, the love and joy that we can share when we walk together, when we love one another, and when we, we're positive towards the things that God is doing in our church and in our life. God's blessings to you.